Thank you for choosing Dundas Jaffeen's Recess Dryer Vent Box. The expected installation time should be approximately 30 minutes, and the tools required are a screwdriver, four wood screws, a utility knife, a rubber mallet, and a four-inch worm drive clamp. Remove the cardboard instruction sleeve and trim piece from the dryer box. For a gas dryer installation, use a utility knife to cut out gas punch-outs on the top of the vent box before installing. Cut the zip tie to remove the mounting brackets and use a rubber mallet to attach the four brackets onto the sides of the dryer box's indents. Next, disconnect the round to oval duct adapter from the box by pressing the round tabs on both sides. Position the dryer vent box between studs and screw the brackets into the studs, being careful not to over tighten. Ensure the dryer vent box is positioned at least one and a half inches from the floor or the baseboard top to allow for the trim piece to be attached. Lightly squeeze a four inch solid metal duct into an oval shape and slide onto the oval collar on top of the dryer box. At this point, you're ready to install the drywall around the dryer vent box. Once the drywall is mudded, sanded, and painted, simply snap the trim piece into place. You're now ready to connect the dryer duct to the box. Thread the adapter onto either flexible foil or semi-rigid aluminum duct by threading counterclockwise. Connect the loose end of the duct to the dryer using a 4-inch worm gear clamp. Snap the adapter piece back into the dryer vent box and push the dryer into its permanent position, being careful not to crush the duct. To disconnect the duct for cleaning, simply pull the dryer out enough to reach the connection collar. Push the two tabs to disconnect and lightly pull the collar downward. Inspect, clean, and reconnect. For more information about this product or other Dundas Jaffeen products, please visit dundasjaffeen.com.